Face coverings have become a part of our everyday lives, and we have shown you several DIY face masks. We have done everything from the easy no sew face mask hacks, like how to turn your shirt sleeve into a mask, to how to sew the more complicated hospital endorsed masks. Well, today's all about shields, face shields, and we're starting with the hacks. I'm going to show you a variety of DIY face shield options that you can make with things found around your home. But you got to be safe because we have a blade right here Where's underneath. The blade? It's right under the I under the it. peach. Oh, thanks. Yeah, I got you. Thank I got you. you. I, like, I saw it out blade? of the corner of my eye. <laughs> uh, yeah, so we're going MacGyver on face shields today. So. These are going to be things you can find around your house or buy fairly easily locally. And then if you want to know how to do some of these harder ones, we can come up with those patterns too. But mm -hmm. we're going to focus on what we have today. And I have a lot of options for you. Now, I don't have any of the most ideal options. So, But they're all things you probably have at your home. Right. So that's a plus. So you have a clear plastic sheet yep. protector. And that's... It's the crystal clear kind. It's good. It's a little flimsier. Mm -hmm. I have this one that's a little bit stiffer, but it's got a little bit of a tint to it. So neither of those are quite ideal, but they will work. I also have an option in vinyl. And if you have recently bought a comforter or bedding, those typically oh! come in vinyl bags. Yes. So you can just cut the piece of vinyl out of it and you can use that too. So that's a couple of options. I'll show you my other one in a second, but let's get started with this. So what we're going to do is we're going to kind of combine a couple of different things to get a shield that fits. Okay. Now, you could just use something as easy as a headband and glue or tie something to mm -hmm. this, but a lot of people say it needs some kind of padding if you're going to wear it over a period of time. Right. So that's why I have felt. And I have just a piece of felt. You've got felt and this gap filler, which is something we had at our house. Also, there's like foam stripping that's like that, but is it has a removable adhesive backing. Right. That works out really well, but that's what I had. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just start rolling up my foam or my um, felt, and then I'm going to just kind of glue a little as I go. And you'll see me do this, and what you'll do when I'm done is just put the um, foam stripping in it. So really, you could just use... You could just use the felt. The felt. I, it's kind of just that, like, whatever you have. Now, this gives it more of a shape that'll stay tighter if you wrap it around something, but yeah. all in all, and it's probably have, the same thing. If you have the foam stripping that's adhesive, that works out really well. Mm -hmm. Okay, so if I got that, I have that like that, and then the next step is going to be, I'm going to take um, some elastic, and I'm going to measure around my head so it's kind of tight. Okay. And then would you tie it or create, like, a clasp? I'm going to adhere it to this. So that's just to measure it. I had to think about that for a minute. I'm like, how am I going to do that? Um, so here, you measure your head. And what I'm going to do is, before I get this all the way done, oh. I'm going to staple this to my piece of felt before I have it in like a big. And you want it to be pretty tight, right? Yeah, you want it to be pretty tight. Okay, okay so staple that to oh, my felt like this. Scissor. Or Gently hand them to me, what we learned in elementary yes. school. <laughs> just, 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 just toss Wait, it don't over toss here. It. Yeah, okay. So I'm just going to kind of put my staple here, and you can use the stapler. And then I'm going to put my last, I know you still need some glue. I'm going to make sure I don't get my glue in here in my um. Do you elastic. want me to do this part first, though? Yeah. So you, and you, when I'm showing the other thing, you'll have a little bit of time. So, so this should is I learning. cut it? Yeah, you can cut it. So then I'm going to just take my shield here, and I could pick whatever one I want. Let's see. I'll do... So if I'm putting this on first, gluing this to the... Oh, Ow, that's hot! It got on my thumb. Sorry. So I'm going to glue... I'm going to glue this down as I go. Do I continue to glue like yours, or do I just roll it up and you then glue You can just roll it up and glue like one piece, because okay. you don't need to have as much of a roll. And then I've got my last piece of glue there, right? Now it's also a good idea when you have these folders to um, trim up the edges. So, so you could just trace like something round and kind of like... So you stapled it to the end. Now am I going to do the end because my felt piece goes to like a point? Should I do it to the longest part? Yeah. You don't need the whole piece even. You can cut some of that off. Okay. So here I have this ready. I've got that glued in. And I'm just going to put it over my face. Voila. 
That looks good. That looks pretty good, right? So here's the plus. I should probably two. have gotten that a little bit tighter. You're not supposed to touch your eyes either, but when you just have a face mask, it's so much easier to, you know, be doing something and wipe your eye. But yeah. when you have this shield on, you don't touch your eyes. Everyone can see me and everything. Okay, so you keep working on that because that's the other I'm option. Trusting this scissor, now we've seen Thank one you. done. And then the other thing that you can do is, you know, maybe you've got a hat. You could get this just to fix into your hat like this. Oh, yeah. Maybe you want to wear a I headband. Like the hat idea. And you can just put a headband on and just stick it right under, too, like this. And that works. But I'm going to show you one last thing before we go. If you don't have the vinyl or the papers, you can take a bottle. This is a two liter bottle. It has to be clear and it needs to be um, like flat. I'm going to be able to get that done. Pretend I ripped that off. And I'm just going to, I lost my, okay. I'm just going to take my blade and I'm going to cut at the top part here off. So, so you could really get yeah. fashionable with the the fabric you choose or yeah. the piece of you can use headbands or you could find some hat. You know, you can line these. Let me see if I fit. Fit it right. So I'm cutting oh yeah. Oh, oh so I definitely measured my head wrong, I think. That's okay. <laughs> you also need to put the piece of vinyl in, but you're good. You can I, just tie it. We'll cut it and tie it. And so once I've cut this off my bottle, will you hand me the scissors? <laughs> will you hand me the scissors? <laughs> Okay, so then I'm going to cut my last part here. So this is a two liter bottle of water that I just drank right before we got here. I'm going to rip off the label. So then I would just stick this under. And I just, yeah, you would have glued it in at the beginning probably, but. Okay, so I've got my thing and I have this all done, right? So I've just made this perfect. And I made one right before that. I just cut the top and the bottom off and down the side and then voila. So I would attach this maybe with my headband. That's a good hack. Oh my gosh, that's so easy. <laughs> you, you look really good. <laughs> and finally. <laughs> no, actually, you look really good with that. Thank you. And you know, I think it's a fun way to have, you know, a face mask. And just a little tip, when you measure your head, go from here to here, not the whole way around. Not the whole way around. Otherwise, you'll end up with this. I think, let's tell everybody to look on Facebook later, because I have a fun way to draw a pirate on here, if you really want to be special. <laughs> Check it out on Facebook later. We'll be right back after this break. <laughs>